What's going on, everybody? Here's another day of uh, another charity event I'm doing. You know, uh, I've been getting a lot of calls for a lot of charity events. And, I mean, it is what it is. You know, this is a simple, very simple setup. Uh, I'm not too sure of what all they're covering, but it's like an award ceremony, which they did not want me to bring a, a, a big setup. So basically, they just want some jazz in the beginning, and uh, we'll see what happens within the last hour. I know they said no hip hop, so that maybe some people want to dance if it goes to that. Um, so you see what my little tops. You see my little mixer because that's all I'm supplying. Because from what I'm understanding is that this award ceremony supposed to be more talking than anything so you know a little or nothing nothing that uh, I should be taking pictures of it's just real simple and I made it simple I already went out my way with the price so I'm not about to bring and set up scrims and all that because they didn't want it I offered it to them at a very reasonable rate already with the discounted price that I'm giving them for this being a non-profit organization but uh we'll see how it go See you in a minute.
Well, I just finished that um that uh charity event. Um, just small little footage, some some else, and you know, letting them letting the system make money for me. Small. Was, I think I did probably two three hours. No, I'm sorry. Let me rephrase that. I did probably about an hour, hour and a half. The rest of the time they were talking. So they basically just wanted the PA system, but I gave them a little bit of jazz. That's so what I said about going through that extra mile. Um, now they want to do it big the next time. There was a lot of doctors and clients up in there. You got to do these things so you can, um, you know, expand yourself. You know what I'm saying? You, I passed out cards to everybody. I don't care who they were. But um, it turned out real good, and it is what it is. Talk to you in a minute. Another uh, thing I wanted to put in this video, you know, I was kicking it with uh, DJ Jess, Jim Brolic. Look him up if y'all don't know who he is. Uh, the night after this event, and you know, like I was saying, it was they were basically passing out awards, stuff like that, things of that nature. And um, they had this one guy, the last guy, the closing guy. He kept holding the mic all the way down to his belly button. I done told so many people not to do it. I tried to tell them, you know, how to hold the mic. And then at the last minute on his clothes out, well, since he was at the mic down so low, I had to turn up the volume just a touch so people can hear him through the mic. And his last words, he screamed through the mic with the volume all the way up. So in one of my speakers he popped a horn now the meaning the reason i'm telling you guys this is that's where the dry racks come in you know i had a dry rack i sold it now i'm about to go buy another one for four hundred dollars a dbx but the dry racks come in it saves you from stuff like that but uh i'm not so much worried about the speaker you know uh i keep insurance on them and it had pro coverage and all that so it was actually pretty good but uh, invest in the drive right, you know, and save yourself some heartache. You know, uh, thank God I, w I had the pro coverage. See you guys soon.